Squid Game Season 2 hit Netflix last week, so I thought, why not make my own version completely within Excel? Of course, Excel has its limitations, both in real-time mechanics and in graphics. This is my Squid Game-inspired turn-based survival minigame series. First up we have Red Light, Green Light, a classic from the series. In my game, the aim is simple. Make it across the field within the 5 minutes of time limit, choose your level of aggression and away you go. But be careful, be too aggressive and it's game over. Secondly, we have the Sugar Honeycombs, where you are drawn the Umbrella Honeycomb. You must use all your wits to get the piece out of this shape. Snap, pick, lick or dry the piece out as you have to manage just how wet the piece is. If it's completely dry, you risk snapping the piece. If it's too wet, it will fall apart. But don't forget to keep an eye on the clock and get the right level of aggression in your moves. Third, we have the hopscotch. There's six sets of platforms awaiting you. One platform will hold your weight, while the other will collapse and take you tumbling down with it. Do you dare go first, or do you wait to see how the other players will travel? Wait too long, however, and time will run out, leaving you eliminated from the game. Before we check out the next game, I just wanted to say thank you so much for your support the last nine months. It has completely blown me away. Wow. So thank you very much for all of you who have watched, liked, commented, or subscribed. Now let's get back to the Squid Game. Fourthly, we have Russian Roulette, a classic game from the second series. You decide which chamber the round is located in, spin and pull. If you survive, you pass it to your friend for their turn. The game continues until there's only one player left standing. Fifth, we have Rock, Paper, Scissors, a dumbed down version of the game from the second series. You play Rock, Paper or Scissors, and then so does your partner. If you pull the same hand, you play again. If you best your partner, you progress. If your partner best you, it's game over. Lastly, we have the classic Squid Game, the simplest of all my mini games. It's you versus however many competitors remain, a simple game of odds, equal across all components. Good luck. The game is available for free download from the link in the description below. Obviously, there are a few notable absentees from the two seasons of the show in my minigame series. The trading balance here is the limitation of Excel and not wanting to overly rely on enemy AI in your game outcomes. Games like Tug of War were either going to be a pure probability outcome or needed your enemy characters to have stats like weight, strength and otherwise, which takes away from the simplicity of the minigame series that I was aiming for. In the end, I'm quite happy with the balance to be honest. As always, a quick overview of how I made the game. I start always with my checklist, a simple progressive list that outlines everything I want in the game. This is where I work out what steps of what I wanted in the game and how and when they occur. As you can imagine, this link shrinks as the Excel limitations become obvious and the reality of what I wanted to create becomes clearer. From here, I made a tab template to carry across all the mini games to allow a base level of consistency. Then it was a matter of coding into VBA, the game by game logic, in the exact order that you've seen in the game so far. As always, the VBA macros are unlocked and available for you to see and learn off at your own interest and at your own time. While you're here, why not check out some of the other games I've made, or maybe some of the game tutorials to make some for yourself. Thanks for watching and Happy New Year!